What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Mike Lemon back again with a quick update. I promise I'll make it quick. Um, today is day two, um, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Yeah, so I don't know, two and a half days, whatever you want to say, um, of having the clowns in here. If, as you can see, they're uh, pretty much settled in. The uh, blue chromis was poking at the smaller one, which was this one down over here. Uh, the Chromos was poking at him, but they kind of settled it, squashed it, so everything seems to be doing good. Um, they are eating. They ate some pellets on Friday. Yesterday they had some of the LRS uh, frenzy, whatever it is. Um, and then today they had mice, so they're they're eating well. Um, so that's a good sign. They're swimming around, and, and, the, and there's no sign of any parasite, no ick, no nothing. Um, so yeah, I'm happy with it. it, it it's going well so far. Um, I also did get the Ganyapora and the hammer, and let's uh, let's check those out. All right, here we are. Um, I think I just called it a hammer. But I'm not sure. They said it was a torch. Either way, I mean, it kind of looks like a hammer, but if it's a torch and it's bright like that, that's that's really cool. It looks a little more green than that, but um, yesterday it came out a little bit less than this, um, and I actually moved it, wanting to give them some more some more flow and then this morning it's out a little more so i'm hoping you know, you'd think it'd be out or more than this by now but maybe it's just coming out really slow so we will see all right guys here's the ganiopora um you know not a whole lot going on as you can see it's like coming out a little bit this is the most it's extended since i got it um when it was in the store the polyp extension was probably like an inch and a half um so it seemed to be doing well. It didn't look colorful and green like this in the store, uh, but they didn't have the best actinics over it. So it's it's looking really, really green under this one. So, you know, I'm hoping it, it slowly settles in and comes out. I've read some stuff on the Gandhi Report that, that they're not the easiest coral to keep. Um, so we'll see, like I said, if, it, if, if, it, if it's progressing the way it is, like I said, this thing was closed up completely for the past couple of days. And this morning, it seems to be coming out a little. Um, so if it keeps progressing, then you know in, in a week or so it should be you know extended pretty well, um, and then it should be a nice addition to the 75. So again, it was only like seven bucks, so whatever. Um, again, I should be doing an update, you know, by Friday, so we can you know come back and check out and see how all these corals are doing. This is it. This is my temporary 10 gallon stuff full of coral. Oh yeah. Forgot about this little guy. Let's see if I can. He's tiny, but he's doing he's doing fine. I saw he's he's been eaten as well. Totally forgot about him. But yeah, Friday, I'll do an update, let you know how everything's going. Um and when I'm doing that update, we should be a week away from the 75 so all right guys i'm out like comment subscribe let me know what your, your thoughts are i mean if, if you guys have had a ganiopora and it took a while to you know uh to to extend the polyps um or if you've had a torch or a hammer whatever this is and let me know how long you know when you took it home how long did the polyps take to come out because it's a slow process for me so far but again like comment subscribe um and let me know what you guys think mike lemming i am out peace